A brother says, Dear sir, we know that it is haram to have intercourse during menses, but if someone has done it with his wife, then what he has to do for this sin, what does he have to do for this sin? Is the expiation for both husband and wife or just the husband? And is there any forgiveness from Allah or not? First of all, it is a major sin to have intimacy, to have intercourse with the wife when she is having her menses. We're not going to talk about medical harms and, and, and diseases, etc. This is beside the point. It's haram, end of story for us as Muslims. What's the penalty? The penalty was mentioned in the hadith of the Prophet والسلام, that he should give expiation of one dinar or half a dinar. Which one is which? Well, one dinar is equivalent to 4.25. 4 0.25 grams of gold, which means that it's approximately um, of, of the, yeah, almost 700 rials, almost $200, a little bit less. And this is one dinar. Why is that? Because you've committed a sin. So should it be one dinar or half a dinar? Scholars say that if the menses is in its peak, then it's a full dinar. If it's about to dry out at the very end, this is half a dinar. And who should pay them? The hadith doesn't say, but most likely it's only the man who does this because only usually the man is the one who calls for this. Are they both sinful? Definitely, unless the woman was trying to resist and was unable to do so, but without any uh, uh, engagement from her side, inshallah, she is not sinful. Um, is there any forgiveness from Allah? Definitely. Whoever commits a sin and seeks Allah's forgiveness, no matter how big the sin is, Allah is most forgiving.